If you often use a 3D camera inside of After Effects, this plugin is literally for you. 3D5 Pro makes everything 10 times easier when it comes to setting up a 3D scene, and it just got an insane update with new features that will literally change your workflow for the best. The link of it will be in the description, and I got you guys with a 10% discount code for you guys to try it out. And if you already own the script, the update will simply be free, and you'll receive it in your email. So let's not waste any more time, and let's see how it works. So I'll simply open a project like this, and as you can see, the project is just a basic and plain project. But as you may know already, creating a 3D scene is pretty long. You have to create a new camera and then play around with the settings. Then you'll have to simply create a null object to parent it with a the camera. Then you'll have to simply just put everything into 3D and simply position them one by one. This is super long and it takes a lot of time. But with the 3D5 Pro plugin, it does everything with the power of a single button. So all you have to do is simply click on this button right there and everything will be set up. So as you can see, the 3D camera was also created and every single layers were transformed into 3D and placed in the 3D space. So this is actually useful. So let's go in one view first. So as you can see in the UI, you got a Z position slider. This will simply control the position of the camera. So as you can see, if you want it uh, closer to the object or further from the object, you can slide it like that. Now you got the room size. For the room size, is simply how far the layers are from each other. So if I go all the way up like this, the layers are really going to be far from each other and the room of the 3D scene will be larger, simply. So if I put it closer, it's going to be the contrary. I'll keep it at a normal distance like this. Now we got an expand background button. It's self-explanatory. Just click on it and the background will expand. And for it to work properly, make sure that your background is always the last layer in your layer stack. All right. Now you got the expand selected layer so i'll simply select this layer right there and simply click on this button right there and it's simply going to expand it for me so i'll simply just scale it up like this so it can be more natural and you can also play around with its setting right there if you don't want it to expand from the right and or the left you can simply put this at zero and it's all good so now i'll simply make some modification and place everything i, I want it to be and as you may notice, there's a camera shake toggle. If you press it, a camera shake animation will simply start. And as you can see, there are sliders to control it. So if you want the shake to be faster, simply put the frequency up like this. It's going to put it a lot faster. If more movement, simply put the intensity up. If you want the, the speed multiplier to be higher, simply put it up like this also. So you know you, it's really customizable and you, all you have to do is simply play around with the settings that you like the most and yeah as you can see the plugin saved me a lot of time and with this kind of plugin you can make your clients really satisfied with, by finishing their project faster and still keeping the quality and now i'm going to show you guys how you can animate the 3d camera so what you can do is simply click on the camera controller click on p now you can simply start adding your keyframes like this and just start doing whatever you want to do and if i go back and if i go back and i simply put this keyframe smoother like this as you can see the animation is really smooth and i did it really quickly with a couple of buttons only now let's say i want to animate some clouds so i'll just pick this cloud right there click on p and simply animate its position into the timeline so i'll just do that like that and just do some a little thing simple like that Everything is customizable, whatever you want in your scene. You can do whatever you want in, in your scene and you can focus more on the creativity than just setting up the three scene for, what, 30 minutes for it to be perfect because 3D5 Pro will make everything for you easier. So I created this plugin because I used to do a lot of 3D works inside of After Effects. So I said, why not create a plugin that will save me time? And it has really been beneficial for me. So. I'm just sharing it with you guys for you to also get benefits benefits from it to help you being a better editor and optimize your workflow for the best. So with this plugin, you can do crazy things like recreating the Iman Gadzi style or the Houston Cold style with these viral 3D reels thingy. This is actually insane and you can do it 10 times easier than the than the rest of editors that don't use this plugin. And by the way, if you're interested on, on learning how to edit like Iman Gadzi or Houston Cold, don't hesitate to check out these two videos. They're pretty information packed, but they're but they have so much value in them. And I'll see you guys there.